Hey, it's cool AG doll stuff here today. So today I read Josh Touch the Sky book. Um, it was actually really good. Um, it was really fun and I really enjoyed it. Um, there's a skateboarding dog if you guys are interested. Murph's, Murph does some skateboarding, which is really fun. And it's basically about Joss learning about cheering and like learning some cheer stunts and things like that. And wiping out on some waves and feeling embarrassed and having the talent show kind of go wrong and things like that. But it's really good. Um, I really enjoyed the book. Um, it wasn't super short. It was actually a decent read. Um, it's 130 something pages, I think 131 pages. So it's a pretty decent read. Um, it gives you something to do for like an hour or so. Um, so it's pretty good. Um, I really enjoyed this book. So if you guys are interested in getting this, definitely get it. Like I said, this is from 2020. So obviously it's it's this review is a couple years late and you may have already read this book but if you haven't this is joss's second book um so if you haven't had the chance to read it it's on the american girl website for five dollars you can buy it and you can read it or you might be able to get it at your local library if they have it there i don't know if they still get american girl books at local libraries anymore um i used to be able to read them at local libraries but i know they were missing some of them so I don't know if local libraries still have American Girl books or not. Um, you'd have to check your local library if you live in the United States if they have American Girl books there. I don't know if other countries have them in, <laughs> in their local libraries. I wouldn't know. Um, I only know what um, goes on in the United States because that's where I live. Um, they have American Girl books at the local libraries that you can borrow for free. But, um, yeah, um, definitely go check out this book if you're able to, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.